Hi, I'm Brian Hoagley with Real CISO. I wanted to go over how we operate and use recommended products within the platform. So some really interesting capabilities here. As we can see our score, our overarching posture against the NIST cybersecurity framework in this assessment, we took one a little earlier. Now we're looking at the dashboard and we can see how we rank against the top five categories. Well, in order to you know really make that better, we need to hone in on areas that can uh, you know, bring that score up. And there's certain things that we can do, like using unique passwords where multi-factor is not uh, uh, supported. And that's great. We can, we can go ahead and focus in on that and that'll move that process. But sometimes we need products. And products are always very interesting to have to sort through and find within the information security field. So how could we really move the needle and which products can we go actually look for and use? Well, what we started showing are recommended products here. Again, we've assessed each of these tools, each of these products from the vendors and mapped what controls they meet. And by doing that, we can actually show if you were to implement that capability into your environment, how would that move the needle, right? How would you move the score? How would you increase your security posture? Um, and you can do that now very quickly without having to go through POCs, trying to really understand control. We've done all of that heavy lifting for you. So this blue represents by implementing this product here by BitLift, we can actually see how we can increase our de overall detection capabilities and then your overall score itself. So 74.4%, this is just pure numerator or denominator math of uh, your control. This isn't some type of magic scorecard or grading system. It's purely how many of the controls are you supposed to, are you doing out of the ones that you should be. Um, so 74 if we had it in place, 70 if we didn't. But the big area is we've really moved what we're able to do around detection for this client. And maybe that's an area that we should be honing in on because firewalls and antivirus won't save us all from everything. We have to have better detection and response and recovery. But um, I digress. Here you can see where we can uh, move the needle, where that capability has been applied and what we're actually moving, um, you know, forward and up as far as the controls. So these things are, uh, are, are now shown in blue as to what's being done and what can, uh, what can be made better if you implemented this product. And we have a variety of products, you know, that are initially recommended based on the criticality, but at any time, you know, you can move into the marketplace and look at all products or just jump right to recommendations and see all products here by recommendations. So just some ideas on how to use realciso.io. Come take a look, kick the tires, give us a call, let us know what you think. We've launched a new website. Like I said, you can check it out at realciso.io. Take a look, let me know what you think. Thanks.